Looks like you're running late. You know, Barney's been pretty scarce around these parts. Guess his bar tab must have finally caught up with him. Man, you cut the ponytail. Sell out. Hey, Mr. Freeman. I had a bunch of messages for you, but we had a system crash about, I don't know, 20 minutes ago, and I'm still trying to find my files. Just one of those days, I guess. They were also having some problems down in the test chamber, too, but I think that's all straightened out. They told me to make sure you headed down there as soon as you got into your hazard suit. Try hitting Control alt delete Quit looking over my shoulder. You're making me uncomfortable. What are you doing still running around up here? Gordo. You're on Sundial, and we need you on stopwatch. Up to it. Freeman? Did you make sure everything is plugged in? You're invading my comfort zone, Doc. Hey, it's happening! Cut it out! What the hell is going on up there? My horoscope was correct! Did someone pull this fire alarm or something? Come on, Gordon. What are you trying to do? Get me into trouble? Bertal, Bertal, come in. Yeah, yeah, I'm here. What the hell's going on up there? Uh, we had a little accident up here, sorry. Yeah, well, that better be the last accident you have today. Understood? Ah, uh, copy. Damn, Gordon. Time to make tracks, Gordon. D okay, okay. You got me. I surrender. Get away from there, Freeman. I'm expecting an important message. Gordon, don't touch that. Go use another computer. Hands off, Buster. I'm expecting a message any minute. Sergeant Boatsma, report to topside motor pool immediately. Do you mind if I ask you a hypothetical question? Those TPS reports have gotten progressively worse. Hard to find good help these days. Yes, about that. We're going to need you to come in this weekend. What? I've already made plans! Don't worry. I can always attend the next convention. Drat. Do you try to break everything you touch, Gordon? I'd like you to actually show me your degree, Dr. Freeman. Give me some space, Freeman. You'll just, just have to wait until after the test. I'm rather busy now. Keep your busy little hands to yourself, Freeman. Weren't you supposed to be in the test chamber half an hour ago? 
I don't know about that, Dr. Truman. Seems to me that he's just spouting buzzwords in his research papers that he picked up from perusing popular scientific periodicals. Got the wrong airlock, Mr. Freeman. You know I can't let you through here. Hopefully things will die down around here soon. There's been a lot of suits coming and going. Probably Union Busters. you look at that? Freeman actually did show up for work this morning. Looks like somebody here owes me lunch. Well, good morning, Freeman. The sample was just sent down to the test chamber. Good morning, Gordon. At your age, Gordon. For Pete's sake. For Pete's sake. I don't think I've ever actually seen you perform any work at all. My God, what are you doing? How much recognition do you think you're going to get for reproduction, though? You should focus on inventing something new and unique. Hello, Dr. Cross. Has anyone actually even seen your degree, Freeman? Now let's get back to work. We should at least try to look busy. What's the extension for technical support? Yes? Morning, champ. Hello. I trust this morning finds you well. Think you can fix the vending machine too, college boy? We will never hear the end of this. Yeah, you best make like an atom split.
debugging procedure coming up. Why do we all have to wear these ridiculous ties? Heavens, I'm in dire need of some toilet paper. Just a minute. Occupied. I don't think my pacemaker can handle any more of this. Why do you insist on picking over everything in my lab? Triple pleated khakis. Preposterous. That last luxury. It's nothing to worry about. <laughs> 